Hello lovely people, this is John from Barrel Roll Studios and welcome to another episode of Pick Up and Play. This is the series where we're going through The Basement Collection by Edmund McMillan, which is just a collection of Flash games that Edmund McMillan um, released prior to um, Super Meat Boy and then Binding of Isaac. And I am joined once again with... Jimmy. And together we're going to go through each of these games and tell you if they are worth buying or not as a whole. Now the first one we played was uh, Coil. Which was kind of confusing. Weird, weird kind of weird plot. Um, long loading times. Yeah. Don't really suggest Gameplay it. Gameplay changed twice in the two yeah. periods. So. And then the next one, Triacnid, which was interesting. I would suggest. I would play it. I mean, like I, I thought it was entertaining. I mean, I'd like to explore more. Like, we only played for a few minutes, but I'd like to see how it evolves as like a game. You mm -hmm. know? And next up we got Ether. Ether, which is uh, a little bit more well known. Yeah. You wanna mom um, jump on first? This will go Ether A classic. Yeah. So you played this one before, or you've heard of this one before? Yeah. Yes, I have. The story is told of a boy with a lonesome who strayed a bit far from his home. As daylight grew dimmer, he saw a faint glimmer Ooh, lost in the wake of Siphon. Whoa! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is a deep for for us. the boy who had feeling that this his monster was kneeling to offer his hand to a friend, the boy darted away, but then turned up to stay, afraid of the message he'd send. He lowered his head, and the boy bustled up, looking proud atop his new steed. Blah blah blah. blah. Let's get it's into gameplay. Of, yeah, <laughs> I mean, it's cool if you want to go back and read through that yeah. on your own. It seems like, kind of like a cool introduction, but let's get into the game. Uh, let's see how we do this. Oh, here we go. Alright. It's kind of like uh, Mario he... Galaxy kind of took this idea. So did Ratchet and Clank. Um, oh, yeah. Alright, here's a house. So that seems important. I'm jumping on that phone. Can I get off this thing ever? Hmm. We're off to a blazing start here. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna click on the house. He he won an award for this, right? Um, I think he might have. Because in Indie Game the movie, which is a great movie that if you haven't seen, you should. Netflix streaming. Um, I think this is the award he accepted and then proposed to his girlfriend, right? Um, was that that, or was that a different game? I'm not sure. He was with a team on that. Um, wish this would work. I just don't. Uh, hmm. Maybe. We should, maybe Why we'll, don't you exit out and yeah, then look at we'll, the controls? What? We'll, well, yeah, we'll look over this. Um, do not panic, viewers. We are only doing this because we do not know. Like we uh, might have to do this on our own. New prize, new steed. The boy had ventured. So we have to get into space somehow. It looks. Or no, he was in space. Yeah. Truly a tale that no one will forget. All right. Oh. Controls. Use W A S D to move in space. Click a cloud. When latched to a cloud. To shoot use your tongue at it. Interesting. Okay, so we use the mouse. Oh, Ooh. so we do have. I don't know if we're. That's something, I guess. Hmm. Well, nothing there. There's one. <laughs> Quick, grasp onto it. We got a swing, maybe. Oh, I thought I was gonna be able to land on the cloud. Guess not. So you have to use it as a Spider-Man. <laughs> yeah, exactly. More it's like Spider-Man, Ether. Except there's no, uh, no weird dancing scene in the <laughs> third one. <laughs> oh no! Please don't mention that. <laughs> uh, oh wow, this is actually mad cool. It's kind. Of, you know what it kind of reminds me of? It kind of reminds me of like Doodle Jump. Yeah. Just kind of. I don't know if if this is all the game has to offer, 
but uh, I don't think so because I remember. I mean, just looking at the mo indie game the movie yesterday, there was a he mentioned you go around to planets and help people out, and uh, each one's kind of symbolic. I guess we just gotta find the planets. Oh, maybe that's what these moss things symbol. There's one. That's not a planet, but I don't know what I'm at. I'm gonna follow this moth. And it's it's easier to swing now that I'm up here in. Uh, no gravity. No gravity. Yeah, you're just kind of flung. Yeah. That's really cool. The, um, yeah, that's the physics change. That is actually mad cool. I guess I don't need to really. Just need to get a good swing. Now give it a try. Yeah, sure. You, you you can keep going for a little bit. I don't mind. I don't mind watching. This is interesting. Well, now I'm. Whoa! Whoa! whoa. That is quick. Oh, see? Now I, I think I'm falling towards the planet. That is really, really cool. Yeah. Wow. Is it, that's actually very cool. Here we come. Yeah, we're getting on something. Ah! ah wait, what? Didn't, that's... Didn't help me at all. Yeah. So let's see if we can find any of these creatures. I, I just realized that... There's something. I'm happy when I'm dead. Oh, right, I'll be dude. happy when I'm dead. That's kind of depressing. I wonder... <laughs> here's some little people. I don't know what they mean. Um, I don't know what this is. Whoa! Oh. Hey, buddy. It's sad to be alone. Oh, man. This Been is a there. depressing planet. Um... Okay. <laughs> they all kind of have a general consensus that it's sad to be alone. <laughs> oh, even look at the core. The planet. It's a sad Eesh. core. <laughs> what did you have to say? Right, I gotta get out of here. Oh, what is this? At least no one can hurt me here. Oh man. There's more diamonds. Or... I'm gonna grab one of these ones on the ground. Sound like it's like a combo system. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Ether. <laughs> <laughs> well, it seems. I guess our five minutes is probably ending soon. Yeah, you're probably right. Well, um, final thoughts on this game. Very impressed. Uh, I yeah, much more impressed than the other two, which I like the last one. I like yeah. Technid or whatever. Triacnid. Triacnid. Yeah, but this, uh, but this one gets better and better. Gold star so far. Yeah. Um, John didn't even play. Yeah, that's probably why. I, I curse these games. Meh. Where's my little? This isn't COD. <laughs> so anyways, thanks for watching. Uh, this has been another um, installment of Pick Up and Play Basement Collection Edition. Um, I'm John. I'm Jimmy. And go to Barrel Roll Studios' YouTube page and look at all the other lovely, shiny videos that I have to offer. And also check out the podcast that me, Jimmy, and Not Pictured Forest are, um, are in called Cool Nerd Podcasts on coolnerdpodcast.podbean.com. Link will be in the description. So thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you later. Thanks for watching. I really, really appreciate it. And if you really, really appreciate me, why don't you go over to my channel and give me a subscribe button hit. I make content regularly, and you should go check it out. It's not bad, or at least so I've been told. And here's some videos that you can check out if you're still uncertain.